Doctors at Children's Hospital of Philadelphia pioneered a new surgical intervention that allowed a baby there to temporarily survive without a heart. Now, this is just an amazing story. Health reporter Stephanie Stahl joining us now with an exclusive look at how the little baby was saved by this. It is a remarkable story. You know, this baby's heart was failing fast and traditional treatments weren't working. That's when the desperate family turned to CHOP, where the team there created a first of its kind intervention. Oh, hi, how are you? He's the baby who lived nine months without a heart. Can you believe it? Dr. Katsuhiro Maeda says the dramatic intervention was the only way to save Michael Webb's life. We take out his entire heart. The baby was born in Virginia with very complex heart disease. Very scary because I didn't know what to expect. Everything had failed when the Webb family ended up at Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. CHOP's willing to, to, to do what they have to do to save lives, and that's why we're here. Michael needed a heart transplant to survive, but he couldn't be stabilized with traditional surgical options, so the CHOP team devised an innovative way to replace his failing heart with a combination of mechanical devices. I knew that this was really high risk, and also, be honest, I was not sure this really works, but, but I believe that this works, so that is why we tried. Something you've never done before. <laughs> that is correct, yes. And they, they explained the odds, and it was 50-50. We, we jumped on it because 50% chance was better than the zero we had. We were uh, terrified, but also hopeful that it would work and he would get to transplant. In December, a donor heart was found. It was a Christmas miracle. The heart transplant surgery was a success, worthy of a send-off party as the family left the hospital. Tell him I appreciate you saving my son's life. Like, yeah. it's amazing. Now the two-year-old comes back for checkups. He's doing good. He wants to get down and play. <laughs> it's remarkable. I'm so glad that this worked. It was a risky experiment that doctors say now offers new hope for others. And Michael's parents, Ashley and Rick Webb, say they are especially grateful to CHOP. Five other hospitals turned them down and said they couldn't help baby Michael. Oh baby Michael gosh. now has a new heart. He, I saw him yesterday. He is back home in Virginia <laughs> oh and doing really well thanks to all the hard work and great people at CHOP. Be that great. is an amazing story. Isn't and it? Just, yeah, amazing care at yeah. one of the best hospitals in the world. It is. We're and lucky great, to have it. The great it. news and story we needed today. Yes. Thank you, Steph. Thank you, uh -huh. Steph.